G'day Oz ADV Rider, I'm just leaving Denbrook with Andy from First Light ADV. We are on a three day Victorian high country trip. Weather is not looking promising today. Um, yeah, middle of autumn. Um, something I didn't take into account when I planned this is daylight savings ended, so it's going to get dark early. Yeah, we're heading for La Cola today. It's been a while since I've ridden out the eastern side of Melbourne. It is absolutely beautiful. Beautiful and green, lots of ferns. So that's Andy in front of me from First Light ADV. He's on his 1990 KLR 250. I'm on my 08 uh, Suzuki V-Strom 650. Now Andy said he's got some interesting tracks today, which really worries me because I've done these easy cruisy rides before and they're pretty tough. <laughs> We'll see how we go today. He uh, said there's a lot of quite a lot of steep hills and they might be clay, so we, we may have to skip some of them. Had a bit of rain through the area in the last few days. The three hour ride from Ballarat to Jambrook wasn't much fun. Friday morning, got all the, uh, the early morning commuters, it was raining, and yeah, it just wasn't very pleasant. We're just out of Niram, starting to hit a bit of mud. Whoa, bloody hell. Oh, she's off camera. Oh, no. Oh. Oh fuck, where's he going? Okay, I got watered down my glove. That was pretty deep. <laughs> Follow Andy's line, I guess. Looks like it's working out alright for him. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. We're good, we're good. Oh. Bit of a drop in that last one. Oh, yeah, that's what I was worried about. Do I go right over? A bit hard from here, isn't it? I'm gonna stay on me butt. Oh shit, that is soft. So I'll just stick for that. It's gonna go in there, isn't it? Unless I go flat out. Jesus. Tires are clogged up now. Needed a run up, didn't I? No, 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 no. that back over so we don't go sideways I'm gonna get right in that left hand bit there I reckon I 
I should be able to, I just need a better run up. I stopped. Did you go left or right? Give it a go. If it's, if it's hard, it's going to get much steeper. So it does. Yeah, yeah right. I'll, I'll try it again. I just I rolled up to it then took off. Did you go left or right? Yeah. Left. Yeah. Oh, mate. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it gets worse. Yeah, I couldn't get any speed up, I was bloody close to getting up there. If I had a better run up, I would have been right. He said there was another hill after that, much steeper and downhill. So uh, he didn't want to go and get, get stuck. Go, go, go! Day two, we end up camping on the side of the road on uh, Mount Useful. Didn't quite make it to La Cola. It's getting dark and uh, the rain slowed us up a lot. So this is camp for the night. Rained off and on until around midnight. Had a sad little fire. <laughs> it's a bit wet for that, wasn't it? Yeah. Fog starting to lift though, so hopefully we get a nice day today. There she goes. Oh, <laughs> oh mate. She's cold this morning. Little Kayla, I didn't want to start. So the uh, first plan today is just to get to La Cola, and I think we're going to head out to the Pinnacles and just go from there. Ooh. Well, the sun has come out. Look at that. It is beautiful. It's still pretty fresh, but it's a beautiful morning. Right, I know, just leaving La Cola. Stop for fuel, quick bite to eat. Oh, that's not, that's not Andy. That's not Andy. Here's the McAllister River. So next stop is the Pinnacles. I'm going to head for the Pinnacles, assess the situation and go from there. Oh mate, I don't like this bridge. Eek! Just at the Pinnacles, about to head up the stairs. Oh, if you can call them stairs. Oh. <laughs> 
be all right. Yeah. yeah. It's hard work. I think get out of the track we had to walk up to get here. That's a bit of it. I can just see Andy up there. Well. Yeah. We'll just wait here for a sec. Oh, shit, he's gone down.